Last part, Steve. Last part. So we're at Cumberwell on their blue nine. And um, if you haven't seen the last part and you like good, solid golf, don't watch it. If you like incidences and idioticness, Incidences isn't it word? Oh, but, so, yeah. oh that, but that sums that, that, yeah, sums well, that part go. up perfect. Absolutely. It's, um, yeah, things happen. Things happen. Bad thing. But we've got, the last three holes here are great. This hole's quite a hard par four. The par three, you, you haven't seen it, have you? Nope. Over water, it's epic. And then the par five is quite tough, but you could make birdie if you had a good drive. So this match isn't over. You are one in front, though. I am one in front, though. At two over par. At two over par. Standard. Standard, standard Stevie Buzz. Slinging it. Good? I think so, yeah. Yeah, pretty sure. Pretty sure. I'm, I'm not 100% on the line. It does, it certainly sweeps down to the left. I think that is really good. Really good. I do have a course planner at home, which I, in hindsight, could have brought. Yeah, we could have just asked one in the shop. Or we could have got one in the shop. Or I could have brought my GPS. But we're doing it all natural. Right, follow that then. Follow that. This wind hole suits James's shape. I expect a good one. Yeah, and I'm right. So that's slightly straighter line than mine, but I think that's okay. Came back in the end. Yours is def you yours is yours is fine. I, I'm I've either cut the corner a bit and I'm good, or I might be in the left rough. We'll have to see when we get down there. Hopefully the rough. Hopefully, yes, because I'm great from the rough. I like your thinking. So we both hit good drives, both on the fairway. I'm a fraction further up on the left-hand side, but only by a few yards, so we're going to be playing the same shot. How far did you have? 114. 114. Got the wind on our backs now. Little 56. 56. Poke it in there. Yeah, it's a little early. downhill and a little downwind, so it's not going to take a great deal. You're sinking birdie. Bit, but it's not horrendous. Oh, it's Mr. Green! Wasn't expecting that. Bit pulley. Bit pulley. Is good. Yeah. Does that mean though that if I'd have hit it straight, you wouldn't have got there because I pulled it? <laughs> Maybe. All we can agree on is you could have Mr. possibly Green. had a birdie putt of good chance. Not well, so I've much now. Oh, that's the confidence. I was yeah. trying to wean the confidence oh, out yeah, of you. That's what it was. <laughs> <laughs> By talking rubbish. Hey, Steve's ball in the fairway. How far have you got? 100. 100. Right on the number. It's a nice yardage. Yeah, it's like a smooth. It doesn't look that far though, does it? Are you 50 18? No, I got 60. 60, sorry, 16. Oh, yeah, sorry, yeah, my most lofted. No, I don't carry a 58. Yeah, what are you talking about, you know? <laughs> so, yeah, it doesn't look as far as... Must be some dead... I suppose a bit of dead ground. Yeah, there's quite a bit of dead ground good, there. Good example Please. of that's what architects try and do. Yeah, I think you go 54 and thump it. Must be a nail in the coffin if this is close. There. It's alright. That exactly where I was aiming. Good distance. Gonna say something stupid now. I know. But you know when it's downwind, it's actually quite impressive how your eyesight almost it almost zooms in a bit. It almost fact no. Just me. Maybe I've got a more superior eyesight to you. Do you know what I mean? So when you're looking at it, as it's downwind, you can see it as a short no. Get in the buggy. <laughs> <laughs> I came up, I said to my dad yesterday, 
I said, do you think in football, when they get a free kick in the hat, they could ma maybe kick it to the corner flag like they do in rugby, and then, then they, get to, they get the throw in? And my dad like paused and said, Steve, that's a, that's a stupid idea. <laughs> one of your more stupid ones. Oh. Maybe when I'm thinking in my head I need to ask myself it before I then let the world know, maybe I think. Ooh. So James has missed the green, but it's not that hard a putt and it's very makeable to be honest. Just got to, I mean, you've just got to assume it's going to come out of the fringe, okay? But there's not much slope. There's not much slope. Oh, it's a good effort. Good par. Very good par. You know that one. Thanks. I'm not even going to put it in. <laughs> right, Stephen. Just to really chuck a dart to the heart. A dart to the heart. Take it away. Pardon? Take it away. Yeah. It's a shame. I broke quite a bit then. This next hole is epic. Let's get over there. This match is not okay. over. Eighth hole on this nine. Give it a yeah. how good it is. This is such over a good this hole. pin back left over this water, water to the left of the green. 233 yards of watery yeah. goodness. I got. I played a county match here. I'm not going to mention the lad's name, but it was into the wind, and he's trying to rip a three wood, gets it wrong, and hits it at that green, and clears the water, and he had 130 yards in. This is a long way. So you got your four. I got my four, and the wind's off the right. I can't really afford to. I need it to help it back round rather than hit into it. Yeah. But it's almost aimed at that middle portion. Not really the putt you want, but I think you would take it if it was offered. Yeah, anywhere on there. Just launched it high. Didn't see it. <laughs> where is it? <laughs> exactly where I said. Middle of the green? Uh, yeah, but nearer the front. Oh, really? Yeah. You've hit that good, haven't you? I've hit that very good. I pushed it a bit. I did. I couldn't afford to turn it over. You could even hit it in the pond from there. I'm just going to hit the same. But I'm going to try and hit the low one. Yeah, it's got to start where mine's finished. And then let the wind work it in. I, I kind of hit it into the wind just a little bit more. This has got to go right. Like, I've got to hit this properly, otherwise it's not going anywhere near it. Yes. Just with this wind, you almost cut one eye, but then you're going away from the pin, and it's kind of counterproductive. Oh, James, stay on that line. Where is it? I didn't see it now, there was a perfect line. Yeah? But I like the shape. See. Going on my one and against that, that was the shape and the starting direction, so I think that could be good. We'll have to see. Bit of a glare in the in the sun today, so we can't see, but we'll get down there and find out. Just on the left fringe, I think. <laughs> right, it's on the green. Steve's left himself a fairly hefty kind of 50 foot putt. I've actually knocked it pin high. That was one of my better shots. Lesser spotted today. Uh, Right, so I'm also on attending GT, so forgive the camera work if I have to run. Hopefully not, I hope you can lag this up. Oh, he's topped it. Oh, God. Just let the... 
Mm. It's almost like you topped that one. So I had it taking some pace off it. Just not trusting. I've actually got the greens are a really good speed, and I'm I've got the speed. You know, I'm a bit afraid of leaving it short and giving it some bottom hands. That's a bad part. This, it could be massive for this match. Let's see what James can do. This is, it's such a good tee shot. And it is such a hard tee shot and to get it there underneath the hole. I, I'd like to see him hold this. It would be a great birdie on this hole. Giving himself perfect opportunity. Pretty much straight out, I don't think he's inside the hole. Let's see what he can muster. Pull it. Bit of a pull. Good part. Not a very good part. Good part. So I need this one, don't I? So I'm am I one ahead of the minute? One ahead at the moment. Little off the left. Yeah. Okay. Just lacked a bit of pace. Good read. Oh, tied up. Woo! Well, five to finish. Wind is helping the shape. It's a bit of a right to left, so. Let's shoot do this. Out. Shoot out, shoot out, shoot out. So we have made it to the last hole. Both three over. There's been some good, some bad, some ugly. Very ugly. Some very ugly. So this is a par five to finish and it's into the wind. Runs alongside the first par five we played on this nine. But it's hit the fairway. It's not anywhere near as long as the other one, so got a chance of getting at the green even into the wind. James. That's nice. Thanks Steve. Very, very nice. Such a beautiful part of the course. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? See, that, that the yellow, that part three over there that we played. Yeah, over there, where they are over there, yeah. Just a really good... Nice, isn't it? Yeah. Would have liked to have seen you make birdie on the way. It's such a good tee shot. But that's in the past now. That is in the past, this is the present. This is the present. Live in the present. Oh, spanked it. It's up past mine by a good 30 yards, that one. Oh, a lovely oh, shot by oh, a lovely man. Nice. Follow you. Okay, so Steve, in the fairway. 215. 215. Hybrid. Hybrid. I, I think I've got to try and get it. It's uphill into the wind, it's playing 240, 250. Oh, he's hit a good one. Go on. Go on. Just turned on the wind a fraction. Just drifting left of the pin. Good distance. I hit that shot exactly how I want it. Into this wind said it earlier, if I had my UT, my 18, didn't mean I'd be thinking that, but I haven't. It's chased up there, I think that's okay. There is a bunker on the left. This is getting me thinking like, is four iron enough? Honestly, I don't think it is. Of course it is. Go on then. 
I feel like one eye and I can't control it to keep yeah, it. Yeah, you, you have to, you, at least you can draw the four. I think you have to cut the one and that yeah. probably doesn't work that well. It's the same shot as the last. Yeah. Oh, it really has. Left side. Left side. Yeah. Good right. lad. So we're both up there. We'll see what's going on. Okay, we are both on the green. Not overly close, but not too far. Both got probably, uh, Steve's got about 30 feet, I've got about 20. One of these drops, that's pretty much game over. Good for the line as well. You know when you, you know when you hit the first one, or no, you know when it leaves and you go, that's on line, that's got a chance. But it gets halfway and you're like, oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. So James, he's now thinking two putt, put some pressure on me. I reckon he's got a bit more slope than I have. I might be wrong though. Going, it's in. Going, it's in. Oh. Well, that's given. So now I have. So I have a. Yeah. Well done. Birdie to finish. So a must make, Steve. A must make. Very much. I left. I hit the first one really hard. You know, on the last. Yeah. Got to be better than that. It's Go on, slot it in, it'd be nice to have half. Jokes. Yeah, well done. Nice putt, very Cheers, good. Man. That's Cheers, a, enjoyed that. That's a nice, good, good finish. We, I followed your tee shot, then you followed my second in. Um, had, had a really good time at Cumberwell. And I, what I a place. Yeah, and I genuinely, if you're ever looking for a holiday, I would, I would come here. I mean, they're not paying me to say that. I mean, they help, they help us out the PGA West region. I mean, they are good guys here. They, it's always quite friendly. And Worth it, a check out. Yeah, and, it's, 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 and it's, it's great fun to play as well. It, it is. is isn't it's it? always in good nick. The greens are good. Yeah, and I, I enjoy, I enjoy coming here. It, it's, it gives you birdie opportunities, but it's, it's not easy. But it, it's one of those. It does reward good shots. But like, yeah, you're quite close to Bath, so if you if you were ever looking to play somewhere, I mean, we've done three of the nines. They do have a Lynx one as well. I, mean, I I like this nine. It's a bit quirkier than the other two. Yeah, a lot more blind shots yeah. on this one. But there, there's probably two or three like spectacular holes on this one. Yeah. Where's the other? It's just good. It's just good options. Everybody likes options. 